Whoa, I was white. <sighs> Hello, my friends. I am back after my two-month hiatus. So I was gone for two months because I was working on my online classes. And I just wanted to focus on uh, the online classes. Um, it was a wild ride. So, although I only had two classes, it was a little, I don't want, I don't want the light to be in my, like, the reflection, so I, I'm going to take them off. Wow. So, let me, let me step back. So, with these online classes, it was the first time I've actually taken classes that haven't been total bullshit. So um, last year I took a Photoshop like 102 and like a geographical mapping class. And this year, these last past two months, I took psychology classes. So every week I had to write uh, two essays. So one essay per class. <sighs> and some weeks were better than others. Uh, thankfully, I didn't have a seizure for, uh, or during this process. But on the first week of these online classes, I was like super overwhelmed. Uh, the first day of classes, I burned myself out. I, I read every, like, uh, for one class, I, I like read everything read a whole lesson in like five hours and just burned my brain out and I had uh, I'm gonna say like f I had four auras that day so I just that taught me just to like take everything slow um, pace myself so these online classes were kind of like going to the gym for my brain so don't so I didn't go, like, too hard every day. I just kind of, like, just paced myself, paced myself, paced myself. And then towards the end, I just, everything was kind of like clockwork. I was like, all right, so I'm going to do research and then start writing my essay and then whatever. Turn it in. And that was that. I mean, it was really exciting. And then during uh, this two-month process, uh, I moved into another apartment. Uh, had uh, had some problems, uh, and then moved out of that apartment. Um, moving is a super exhausting process. Uh, Stress is my trigger. So during these two months, I was like stressed like crazy, but I I was able to adapt, which is really awesome. And uh, how do I word it? I. How do I word it? Uh, what are the words for... I'm going to... What are the fucking words? Uh, you know, those times where, like, you think you have the word in your head, but it just it's not going to come out. Uh, I'm just going to say I dedicate my stress management to um like meditation like the meditation that I do every night before bed and that's how I kind of like keep myself calm during all these like super stressful situations cuz I've had a ton of stressful situations during these last past 2 months but thankfully I hit my 3 month mark and uh, here in Arizona, after you hit your three-month mark, uh, you can drive. So I was able to drive, and that was pretty awesome. <laughs> Excuse me. But when I first drove by myself, it was pretty scary. It was almost like driving for the first time, because I've been waiting for this moment, um for the last past year and a half and 
I was like, I was on the road and I was, I was like shaking. I was like shaking and like my palms were like sweating, but it was, it was just like that, that taste of independence. I was, I was gagging because <laughs> I was so anxious. <laughs> I had to drive to Lowe's to pick some stuff up. So I was like driving and like shaking and then like I was at Lowe's like by myself and like Lowe's is like super overwhelming because like there's shit everywhere. So then I drove back from Lowe's and then I was like a little more chill. And then also I had to drive to my aunt's house. I'm I'm at my aunt's house right now. And my aunt's house is two hours away from uh, Phoenix where I live. So I drove by myself as well. Um, but I was in the, like in a convoy, so it was like my mom, my sister, and then I. So I was in my my own car, and that was actually pretty cool as well because I got to listen to my own music and just enjoy. And like whenever I got anxious, I just like turn like uh, put the windows down and just got some fresh air. But you just kind of uh, get used to it, really. It's like I said, it's like learning how to drive again. <sighs> but um, yesterday I had to, tr- uh, I went to go turn in some forms uh, to a doctor, like drive to a doctor's office to give them some forms and stuff. So I drove there and it wasn't too bad. That was actually pretty cool. Oh, what else? Oh, and my friend Tabs, she's in uh, our Discord server. She hit her six-month mark. So congratulations. Congratulations, Tabs. So her her six-month mark, she's able to drive. So congratulations, Tabs. Claps. What else do I have? And so basically... That was my two months. It's been a pretty wild ride. And then what else? What else? What else? What else? That's it. I'm just, I am honestly glad that I'm back and I can make videos. I mean, this first video was pretty quick. A nice little update. Drink some water. If you would like to join um, the Discord server that my friends and I are in, we support each other. We're all epileptics. We just talk, um, share memes, listen to music with each other. Um, what else? Uh, we just share things about our lives. It's honestly pretty awesome. It's exciting. I love it. It's my favorite. Uh, we're always on it, so if if you'd like to join, the this link is in the description below. So thank you for the opportunity. Uh, thank you for giving me the opportunity of sharing this with you. Love you guys. Peace out, Girl Scout. See you guys later.